Welcome back to another gameplay video. We're going to be doing another XPVP match. Dylan901, who has commented a lot, has been asking for this uh, many times. Basically on every single video. And uh, so we will... I will move this forward, Dylan. So this is for you, sir. Uh, I'm going to get this video up quicker uh, so you can see yourself being a boss. Um, this is a 4v4 sandbox. Um, we are down one flag to nil because... Uh, somebody on the red team capped a flag when we were not a full team. Um, also, in addition to Dylan, there's Mr. Geo Moon and Bloody. Uh, Bloody is certainly a character. He's known for trash talking. His favorite trash talk phrase is dog bark. Apparently, that is trash talk in some language or country. Not sure. Anyways, so we managed to tie up the game and I get triple shot. So I'm at the bottom of my team, like usual. Um, yeah, move forward. This was a mistake. I should have gone behind, but I'm able to get a shot off on him. Um, and then Sir Cut hits me, and I hit him, but unfortunately, um, don't get the kill. And then we have a runner. Um, in these XBVP games, there are a lot of runners. I'm not sure why, but it seems to be a thing. So we're just going to sit here. Uh, Sir Cut is going to press forward with the attack. And so is Geomode. And this is something that's really frustrating is when you're playing these games, um, everybody knows that we're that we are outnumbered, but people use it to um, gain extra kills. I don't think Geomode's doing that. Circuit certainly is. Um, and now I will start lagging, which means everybody around me is breaking, which is fun. Um, at this point, we're just going to sit around and wait for somebody else to join. And finally, uh, we have a new player, Angel60, join our team, and we are able to continue the game. So Dylan is up on the top. Um, we got a push on the right. I get frustrated by these, where one player is running forward, and you have to either uh, choose to shoot forward first or choose to shoot second. And what always happens is I guess wrong, and there I guess wrong, and Bloody's able to get a kill. I'm able to take out Geo Moon in the corner. And Bloody is still alive somehow. He recently got his mint paint. Um, so we're going to push the right side. Dylan and I are both going to fire. Dylan should be close to ranking up soon. Um, he will not do so in this battle, unfortunately. But I've um, got the right side. So I'm going to get some shots off, get a couple kills. And uh, we're just going to hang out on their base. See if we can get a shot, and I do get killed. So it does seem to be like we've got a player camping behind the house, which is unfortunate. Angel 60. I hate when players camp. Thankfully, Mr. Img is uh, one hit because he just killed me, so I'm able to get him. And I'm going to press forward. And I usually lose these fights, but in this case, I was able to shoot first, and Sir Cut is taken out. I'm going to try to get double, and I do. Unfortunately, they're both full health, so I'm just not able to do much with it. And then Sarkut gets the kill on me. So, 7 kills, 6 deaths. I have 97, 91 points. And I'm second place on my team. And Dylan is kicking butt with 366 points. I don't know how he's so far ahead of our team, but he is dominating right now. I'm going to get a shot up on Bloody, but unfortunately I missed. Because I'm new and I die. And Dylan has almost twice the score of the next highest player. He is speaking, but and of course they have a house camper now, and people are trash talking in chat, and they always challenge each other to one v one. That proves something, I guess. I don't know. And now double shots tells somebody not to lie, and I randomly get a kill there, which I'm lucky. And Liddy cleans me up though. I still don't understand why people say kid because literally most of the people here are like 10 so uh, why would you call somebody that's when you're clearly a kid why would you call somebody else a kid that doesn't make sense but something that people like to do but regardless I'm going to get a kill off on bloody that's not true I'm going to get one off on Geo Moon. and Dylan is trash talking but he is wrecking so I suppose he can he can say that he is having the game of his life and Pot is, er, Geomoon is buying something, I'm not sure what he's buying, but, oh, mint paint. 
He has actually currently purchased the mint paint. I'm going to push up on the right side, double the shots of the head. He's probably going to get nuked any second, but he doesn't. I'm going to take out that house camper and I aim. And we just target the campers. Um, first of all, because they're so frustrating. Gia Moon is swearing in chat. That's good to do. We get another shot off on Imguk, and I miss like a noob. But there are M2s, they don't kill me, but I'm able to get the kill. I would have not have died if I hadn't been a noob. But Gia Moon is just going to run right into the middle. It's usually a good strategy to just charge out in the open, which is funny because that's something I do. And Bloody does a good tactic, drives right on top of me. And uh, I'm a noob again, I miss another easy shot. So I'm just gonna attack, cut my losses, and I try to take a shot, but unfortunately I miss, and I'm gonna get lit up right here. Uh, sometimes I miss, and I don't know how, but I went from doing well to now I'm third, third on my team. And uh, Geo Moon is cussing in chat again. But he should not have done that, I'm gonna take him out, and then I'm gonna just get wrecked. Dealing with 435 points. Flag is one, he's just been hanging. Angel's been hanging out, guarding the flag. All game. And Bloody is pushing forward. Fortunately, there are three people defending the base. I'm gonna take out the circuit. And I'm gonna take this right corner. And I flip, which is very frustrating. But thankfully, Img decides to clean me up, and for that, I'm very thankful. You know, I wondered who. This is the, t the usernames that some of these people have, and some of them make sense, and some of them I just wonder, like, you just randomly type letters? Like, some of them are very unique, but it's fun. My favorite ones are the ones that are just a bunch of numbers, like when you're trying to tell, talk to them in chat, and I'm a complete noob, but I managed to get the shot off first. Um, like when people's username is like 02479 you're like, just randomly just type in random numbers. Double shots is talking about someone's DL. Not sure who he's talking about. And I shoot the wall like a complete noob. And, uh, I'm gonna charge for it. Let Angel have the flag. And I guess double is not referring to a good DL, but a bad one. Uh, bollocks. Now Geo is cussing in chat again. Seems to be a lot of this. I'm going to get a shot off on nobody actually because I forgot to shoot. And I shoot nothing. And so I just died. I'm losing. I'm an incredible noob. Oh, I see what DL he was talking about. I am an incredible noob at XP. There's just no way about it. I'm playing with a bunch of M2s and I'm still sucking. So, yeah. Circuit gets the kill. Dylan still with 500 points. I'm just gonna call an all attack because we gotta. I'm confident in our ability to take take out the flag if we all. Win. Um. Wow, Geo is just going to town with the trash talking. Um. Note to self: you don't sound, you sound ridiculous. Just anyone if you trash talk. So uh, I'm able to get two kills here, and I'm gonna return the flag. That kind of felt good. And I see my teammate come around the corner, and so I waste a shot. So we have to go up 3-1. to one. Looking pretty good. Circuit grabs the flag. I should be able to get this shot off. And Bloody comes around the corner. Bloody's actually really good. Um, tried to get a 1v1. Not with me, but he was trash talking another character. And I tried to get a 1v1 with him versus that guy. Um, but he didn't want to, and so he just got destroyed. Not sure if people would actually like to see it, though, unfortunately. That would be interesting. Um, it's kind of fun to see when people trash talk and then they get their butts kicked. So I choose not to trash talk about that. Bloody with a good shot, but he actually missed and I get a random kill in the background, which is always nice about rail. And then Bloody gets the kill. So Bloody is still on top of his team, 400 points. Dylan has 517, 27 kills, 24 deaths. He is having a big day. Dominating. Um, Essentially, the only reason why we're even sort of in this game, actually, Bloody and Dylan are carrying the teams respectively. I'm just gonna hang out here, and I'm gonna push up. Still not sure what to do in these circumstances, but I'm gonna get a shot off on Circa, and I'm gonna miss epically because I'm a noob. Try to get a shot off on Bloody, and I'm gonna miss again because I'm a really noob, but Bloody does not miss. So I'll just let everyone know that 
Pond India is a noob, just in case they didn't know. And we come in with a flag. I'm going to take out Bloody and let Dylan cap and return. And he's going to miss the flag base, which is, happens a lot. You feel like a complete noob, but his score is 500, so really. And him dies randomly. Everyone says that I'm a pro. That's only because I'm got Wasp XT. Everybody assumes that you're good, even when I'm not. LOL. Now, Geo Moon tells himself that he is a noob. Which, uh, but to be fair, um, he is getting better. I think he just plays with too hard of, too high level of players. But I enjoy um, him and Dylan play a lot. They're clan mates, and it's fun to see them in the matches together. They always end up on opposite teams, which is also funny. Uh, Geo Moon, keep working, brother. You will get there. Just. You're still better than I was when I was at your level, so... Though, to be fair, I'm garbage now, so I don't think that should be any consolation. I miss an easy shot, as we're talking about me being a noob. 23 kills, 23 deaths. Yes, I just remind everybody that I suck. I changed my mind to try to get a shot off, but that is... I'm gonna grab the flag. And we're going to try that cap, and Dylan's going to push up. And they have a runner. It is their M3 player, so that could spell doom for their team. So I'm just going to chill here. And they get an M2 player to replace their M3 player, which is unfortunate. Um, the game's actually been very good, but maybe this character will be good. We shall see. Bloody is still on the top of his team and I'm just sitting here and my team is just shooting and no one's no one from my team is dying they're just no one's returning the flag but finally they do and so I cap to get in five three gonna get a shot up on the new character and Angel dies suddenly and Geo Moon asks what noob means not sure I'm gonna shoot over him just to let him know who's boss I don't actually want to hit him. I want to shoot over his head. Clearly, I wasn't actually aiming for him. And I'm going to shoot to the right of Adidas so he knows who's boss again. And then he misses too. This time, I'll just shoot him just because I'm tired of telling everybody that I'm boss. I'm just going to actually show them. And then Geo Moon tells everybody that he sucks and that he wants to get rid of his account. I think fixes the problem. Me getting rid of my account and starting over would not make me a pro at XP. Probably nothing that could, actually. And I'm just gonna randomly die. Mr. Belletti will kill me. And then double the shots will just remind us that trading transfers of accounts is forbidden. So, just in case you didn't know that, that's a thing. And Adidas is gonna push forward. I'm gonna get a shot off, and then Dylan will finish up. We'll push on the left side. Im misses a shot. I will not. I will hit the shot. And then I'm going to push forward, which is not a good idea. I will miss a shot again because I'm a noob. But he's M2, so I will not do anything, actually. Geo gets a shot off on me. And I'm going to shoot Adidas and then die. That's actually kind of what's been happening a lot. But we're doing fine. We're up by two. And there are three people in the base. I'm going to take out one. And then die. And then Angel's going to be saying, Hi, six bull. I assume he's calling somebody a noob. But it would help if he used the word noob instead of using numbers in his words. And I'm going to shoot above everybody just to let them know who's boss before I die. Respawn. I'm gonna take out Bloody Free Angel so he can hang out. And double the shots tells us that he might have to leave in a couple seconds. And I'm gonna miss an easy shot. Well, that's not really an easy shot. Um, we're gonna push forward and we're gonna take out Imguk. And then I'm gonna get hit. I'm gonna go for the building. Take out this house camper. Any opportunity I have to take out house campers, I will always do so. 
turns out that they have another runner, but someone immediately takes his place. Oh, he was in fact bloody, but that's good. So the leading play on the other team with the highest score leaves, and the rest of us will get his crystals. And I'm gonna clean up the house camper again. I'm gonna drive in to double the shots just to prove that I'm a noob, just in case anyone was wondering. And I'm having a little trouble turning my turret at the moment. And I'm missing easy shots. And I will die. Not doing too terribly. Dylan is just still kicking butt. 724 points. They've got 390 and I'm in second place. He's just been having a game of his life with an M2. Just to be fair. M2. Kicking major bum. We push on the left side. And I get the shot. And they do have another M3 player, which is good. And I get double shot off. And, uh... I'm going to shoot the wall, just because we don't want this character to actually get hit. Just want to let him know who's boss. And then I'm going to shoot Mguk. What kind of a name is that? And I'm going to shoot double and get a kill. And then I'm going to shoot Geomon again, but he is shot by Dylan. Who is three shot, apparently. And I shoot over everyone's head again. Must have been feeling very arrogant. I just wanted to keep shooting over people's heads. And I'm going to shoot Dylan just to let him know that I'm boss. Instead of shooting the opponent. And I'm going to miss a shot. This is basically the story of this entire game. Just, you know, instead of hitting my opponents, I was shooting over their heads. Missing them. Just so that they knew that I was just, you know, just boss. You know, I was so good that I can just shoot over their heads and still be a boss. Obviously. Clearly wasn't just missing any shots. Like that. I, I was an intentional that I was shooting the wall. Obviously. And I'm gonna shoot the wall again. I'll let Imguk get the kill. Geomoon is actually playing decently. He's in second place. And that didn't really work out very well for me. And just another proof of how much of a noob I am. I wanna shoot Geo because he's going AFK, but I die. So 34 kills, 33 deaths. Still went up to 800. And I get lucky there, and I'm able to get a kill, even though my aim was knocked off. And he just gets taken down. Now we're going to push up. We are now up by one point, six to five. Well, we have the flag. And I'm going to get a shot off there. And I'm going to get a shot off on Adidas. Get the kill. Dylan's going to say, come on, and then he's going to tell us to hide. Geomoon misses the flag. Misses the shot. And then I'm going to die. Uh, but they both teams have a flag. Dylan with 46 kills, 36 deaths. He's just been carrying the team all game long. And I'm gonna miss the shot. Yeah, I forgot how noob I am. Golly. I'm gonna ignore that, and I'm gonna go for the shot of the flag carrier on Surge Vol 1, and that's the game. So we win 7 to 5. GG to Dylan and Geomon. All of y'all. Good game.